Hey guys, Metalhead here, back with the second episode of In Real Life Stories. Before I start, I want to say thank you to all the people that watched the last episode. It's sitting at about 800 views right now, after about a week, I think. I think I put it out last week, but the thing is, I'm not entirely sure if those are like legit views, because I got them all in like two days. They were spaced like two days apart, where I got like 300 views each time. But yeah, I've, I've been kind of worried that somebody might have sent a view bot over to that video, and pretty pathetic bot at that, in my opinion. Uh, which then brings me back to thinking that they are, in fact, real views, but I can't really be sure. <laughs> I don't really know how to check if you can check. I don't know, you let me know if there's a way to check if they could be fake views, but back to the topic at hand. Today I want to tell you guys about my recent adventure in Cloudtown. For those of you guys that don't know, uh, I'm referring to St. Cloud, Minnesota. Uh, I went up there this weekend with a buddy of mine, Spydrone, to visit some friends that just moved into a house from an apartment. Uh, we thought we would go check it out, have a little celebration, if you know what I mean. So to start, we get there at about 8.30 at night, because I had to work till 7, so that kind of sucked, but we found out that they had started drinking at about 10 in the morning. <laughs> Alcoholics, right? <laughs> uh, just kidding, guys. But we start off with a tour of the house, and they have like seven or eight guys staying there, I think. I think that's right, but the one interesting thing I saw was that they have a, a closet and just a chair just chilling in the closet. It was very strange, I thought. <laughs> it, it was like a lounging chair, like something that you, put, you would put in your living room or den or whatever. It was just chilling in the closet. <clears throat> and another thing they have, like this, they call it the murder shower. Nobody showers in it. It it looks like a place where somebody would get murdered. N no joke, a murder shower. But anyways, after the tour, we start the drinking. <laughs> uh, we play some beer pong, which found out I'm not too shabby at. And we played some darts as well. Uh, it was it was all fun, just chilling in the house. Uh, but then we decided we're we're getting a little hungry, so uh, we go out go out on campus and find somewhere to get some grub. But yeah, don't worry, we we didn't drive. We just walked around campus and uh, we got an unexpected tour at least it was unexpected to me I didn't I thought we were just gonna go go get something to eat but it turned out to be a tour first um, <laughs> I don't really know how we even did it cuz uh, most of us could barely walk as it is and here we are walking around campus nobody stopped us which is good but I'm surprised <laughs> uh, but we decided to go to subway which I had no idea that any subway was even open after 10, but it is Cloud Town, the, where the parties happen. But <laughs> but thinking back, we, we were very obvious on how intoxicated we were, and I, I don't even... I, I don't even know what the guy working at subway was thinking. Must have thought we were re retarded or something. We were making a ruckus in the subway. <laughs> it, it was pretty funny, but... Um, but this is... After I tell it, this, this is probably a you-had-to-be-there sort of story. But whatever, I don't really care. I'm putting it up anyways. Most stories are like that. Um, if you guys have any suggestions, again, put it in the comments. I'll see if I can tell you an interesting story about that it could be like first blank 
again. Um, but like the video if you enjoyed, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. I'll see you guys later.